Hi guys, welcome to my kitchen today. Today we're gonna cook stew lamb neck. So right here we have some lamb neck. Uh, we don't have a lot of lamb neck, so I'm just gonna cook a small amount of lamb neck. So we'll just cut them up in a small chunks like this, not too big, not too small. We have one white onion, we have two carrots, we have four cloves of garlic, we have some red bell pepper, some green bell pepper, I have a little bit of yellow bell pepper, I didn't, didn't throw it away. We have some dry thyme, dry thyme give it the same taste and that same flavor. Right here I just picked some spring onion from my garden, I just used the, the leaf, I didn't use the stalk. I just picked three huge leaf from my garden a minute ago. So spring onion, we have some all purpose season, we have some caprica, we have some black we have some pimento, we have some black pepper, we have some meat browning. So that we're gonna use today, we're gonna cook stew lamb neck with white rice today. So guys, if you don't subscribe to my YouTube pages yet, please do. Please share and like the video. Please make a comment and please hit that notification bell. So when I post a video, you guys will get it. So stew lamb neck with white rice. Hi guys, what we're gonna do now, we're just gonna season up this lamb neck. So we're gonna put a, a teaspoon of all purpose season. I'm gonna put a teaspoon there, right there, there. So guys, basically we just put a half a teaspoon of all-purpose season. Then right now we're gonna put a half teaspoon, maybe less than half teaspoon of caprica. Caprica is very strong. So put a little bit of caprica. Don't wanna put too much caprica in it because caprica is very strong. So don't put a teaspoon or a tablespoon of caprica. Caprica is very strong. We're just gonna put a little drop of pimento. We have the grinding pimento, you're the pounding pimento, we don't use the whole pimento grain. So this is the grinding pimento, just put, put a little drop of pimento. A pimento give it a taste, it give it a flavor, that kick in it. So that's what we're looking for. And I'm gonna put a little drop of black pepper, there's a little tip of black pepper we're gonna put in this one, right there. And we have some meat browning. So this is meat brown in here. Meat brown is very strong as well. So be careful how you use meat brown. You don't, you don't want to put the back thing out and just pour everything in it. Because your meat becomes so dark. Just measure it. And I put a less than a teaspoon of meat browning. So when you stir up that one, mix it up. If you need a bit more, you just put in a bit more in it. I don't know where. Just give that a stir. That's it, I put less than a teaspoon of meat burning in it. So the color of the meat changing now and everything like that. So you don't want to put in too much meat burning in it, because you don't want your meat to come so dark. And back in the days when we didn't have no meat burning, we used to use brown sugar. So you get a pot, you put the brown sugar on the fire. No oil, no water, you just melt the sugar, with the sugar melting and getting dark, getting brown and then we use it and show on our meat that's what we used to use for meat browning I used to see my grandmother and my grandfather doing it so now we just use meat browning you see, you see the color of the meat? that's meat browning it's so called cooking stew lamb neck today so we're gonna make that marinate for around 20 minutes so Please subscribe to my YouTube page, please hit the notification bell and please hit the notification when I post a video you guys will get it. So guys I just put a little bit of oil in the pot, I don't want to use so much oil because I don't like to cook with so much oil. So the less oil you can use is better for your health and everything like that. So this is true lamb neck. So we're cooking stew lamb neck with white rice today with um, steam vegetable. So I just gotta burn off this a bit. So 
So guys, right now we're just putting put on some rice. We have two and a half small juice cup. We put in some rice. This two and a half um, small juice cup. So I just put a piece of spring onion. I just pick out the garden. So I just leave the, the stalk of the spring onion in the leaf. So piece of spring onion in that rice and a little piece of butter. So I love to use spring onion in the rice. It gives me that taste. And it's gonna add a little bit of salt in it. It's gonna add a little bit of salt in it. So they give it a stir. So guys, my lamb neck has been burned off. I've been burned at the two sides. So now I'm just gonna chop up one white onion in it. So I'm gonna slice it up like that. So this is one white onion. So today we're gonna cook a um, stew lamb neck with white rice so please hit the notification bell and please share and like the video and please make a comment so we have a lot more recipe coming out so this is i know enough of you guys never eat lamb neck before but try it i'm telling you delicious and we're gonna use a piece of ginger it's gonna grate it. You can cut it up or crush it if you want, it's up to you. But sometimes I cut it, sometimes I crush it, but today it's gonna grate it. Just that. And then we're just gonna grate out the garlic as well. We have four cloves of garlic. As I said before, you can crush it or you can cut it up slightly. It's up to you, your preference. But I grate it today. Clean up there. I'm gonna give it a stir. So, guys, I just take off the lamb neck out of the pot where I burn it up. Now, put it in a pressure cooker. I'm just gonna have some boiling water to it. So I'm just going to push it up for about 15 minutes. And this over here is my white rice. Red rice is coming down nicely. So all I do, I just turn on the fire, the stove, very low on it, to let it steam it. So you don't want to put a blazing fire on any rice when you're cooking rice. Just turn it right down low as possible and then you put the lid on it so let it take your time and sneeze because you don't want to turn the fire too high to make it burn so i'm just going to give this lamb neck for around 10 to 15 minutes on the pressure cooker and then after i'm just gonna chop up the bell pepper and the carrot and the spring onion and put in it Hi guys, uh, my lamb neck I've been putting in the pressure cooker for 20 minutes. So now I'm just gonna cut up the carrot. I have two carrot there, I'm just gonna chop them in the chunks like that. So I don't want I didn't want to put in the carrot meal and I'm pressuring the meat because the carrot and everything with mashed out, I don't want that. So the lamb neck been pressure for the last 20 minutes. So 
So now I'm just gonna put in the carrot and the bell pepper. And I'm gonna put in a tin of beans in it. I just cut up the half of green bell pepper. Just have to just cut it up in some chunks. I don't want it too big or too small. Just put it up like that. Then my rice finished cooked. And then I have some steamed vegetable. I have some broccoli, some peas. I've got your steaming. And red bell pepper. Off and off. You know, I have a little off of the um, yellow bell pepper. I used it the other day, but I didn't want to throw it away. There's a little piece left. So, I'm just going to give that a stir. So, I'm going to give it around 20 minutes. So, guys, this has been cooking for the last five minutes. I'm just going to add in a tin of butter bean in it. So one tin of butter bean, give it a stir, and then I'm going to add two teaspoons of oyster sauce. So I don't want to pour it out in the pot load like that, everything has run out, so I'm just going to put in two teaspoons. Another one. So two teaspoons of ice sauce. And then I just give that a stir, give it around five minutes more. Guys, this is this is my rice. Um, it's all finished now. That's my white rice. And my steamed broccoli there with some steamed vegetable my lamb neck so I'll finish so I just gonna share it out and eat guys I'm starving so please subscribe to my youtube page and please hit the notification bell so when I post a video you guys will get it and please make a comment and please share and like Hi guys, this is all finished now. This is my stew lamb neck with white rice, with beans and some steamed vegetable. Look at that guys, that is so beautiful. So please subscribe to my YouTube page and please share and like and please hit that notification bell so when I post a video you guys will get it. Please make a comment.